And over 3,000 households in Isiolo County have been displaced by floods, with over 12,000 requiring urgent humanitarian assistance. And as Stacey Gashara reports, floods have destroyed homes, roads, and bridges in the county. The ongoing heavy rains in several parts of the country continue to wreak havoc. Following heavy downpours over the past two weeks, at least 3,000 207 households have been displaced, while 12,802 households are in need of urgent humanitarian assistance in Isiolo County. The Isiolo County government held an emergency meeting with officials from the Kenya Red Cross, the National Disaster Management Authority, and representatives from over 30 NGOs and community-based organizations finding ways of dealing with the rising humanitarian crisis caused by the floods. Isiolo County Secretary Dade Boru, who led the deliberations, expressed concern over the worsening flood situation. He noted that some areas are completely cut off from relief food supplies. Between Marty and the Dutch Basa uh, has been uh, washed away. There is uh, no road as we are talking because flood is all over. Vehicles cannot move from Marty to the Dutch Basa. The Kenya Red Cross County Coordinator Gregory Masharia said they are monitoring the situation in flood-prone areas. As organizations, as the government, uh, we sit together, plan together, so that we ensure that we reduce on the numbers that might be affected during this particular time and at all costs avoid any loss of life and even reduce on the losses of livelihood as a result of uh, the, the El Nino effect. County government, we have uh, responded to, uh, to effects and the impacts of these floods together with the Red Cross, uh, uh, which help us to provide food items. And us as county government, we have provided food to those affected. According to the officials, at least 2 million Kenyan shillings is needed for emergency interventions until January next year. Reporting for Citizen TV, 